Hi, I'm Jen from Online Fabric Store. Maxi dresses are great to wear in the summer. Today I'm going to show you how to make one out of cotton jersey, so let's get started. The materials you'll need are two yards of cotton jersey, I'm using Robert Kaufman Royal Laguna Cotton Jersey Fabric, thread, fabric scissors, ballpoint needles, and ballpoint pins. Fold the fabric in half. Line up the center of the skirt pattern to the fold line. Pin around the pattern and cut. Fold the remaining fabric over about 10 inches. Pin the front top to the fold line and cut. Fold the fabric over again. Pin the back top to the fold line and cut. Remove the pins from the skirt pattern and unfold. Starting one inch in from the side, make a one inch pleat and pin. Continue this all the way across, leaving one inch at the end. Space the pleats about two inches apart from each other. In total, you should have 12 pleats. Once the pleats are pinned, baste stitch across with a half inch seam allowance. The settings on your machine should be set at 5 mm in length and 4 mm in width. A base stitch is a straight loose stitch to help keep the fabric in place. Back stitching is not necessary for this stitch. Before you start sewing, make sure you are using a ballpoint needle. This needle is made to work with stretch knit fabrics. Remove the pins from the pattern pieces. Pin one side of the front to one side of the back and zigzag stitch with a half inch seam allowance. Your machine should be set at 2.5 millimeters in width and three millimeters in length. From the bottom, start a half inch in and leave one inch at the end. The zigzag stitch will help the thread stretch with the fabric. Back stitch at the beginning and the end, leaving the other side open. Pin the bottom of the top to the skirt with the right sides facing each other. Zigzag stitch with a half inch seam allowance. Backstitch at the beginning and the end. Line up the side seam with the right sides facing each other. The dress should be inside out. Pin from top to bottom and zigzag stitch with a half inch seam allowance. Start one inch in and leave two inches at the bottom. Backstitch at the beginning and the end. Fold the center seam over. Pin and stitch with a quarter inch seam allowance and fold to the right side. Starting from the side seam, fold the edge over a half inch twice and pin. Then straight stitch along the front and back with a half inch seam allowance. For this stitch, make sure the width is 4 mm and the length is 5 mm. Back stitch at the beginning and the end.
Starting at the seam, fold the fabric over one inch twice and pin. Continue this until you've reached the end. Then stitch with a three quarter inch seam allowance. Backstitch at the beginning and the end. The maxi dress is now complete. You can mix and match different colors or prints or add a sash for a different look. Thanks for watching this OFS project.